Hello and welcome to the another workflow and tip clips. Good day to everyone. If you have been following my earlier videos on node selection and element selection, today's clip is the extension of selection to interpret some of the results. But what differently we are going to do in today's clip is we will be using the API to check upon the flatness and roundness of the feature. Probably if you have been working with the engineering team or product development team, you would be always asked some of the questions related to the flatness and roundness of the features. Now there are multiple ways to provide the results of roundness and flatness. Few of them are like in plotting the XY plot or path plot and we can check the eccentricity of that with respect to the centroid or we can also plot along the length and see that how the flatness is getting uh, in a Z direction. In today's uh, clip, I'm not going to plot any of such. I'm going to use a little smarter way to present uh, uh, those results. So let's get started. As you can see that I have a component where I would be measuring the eccentricity of this particular feature and the flatness of this surface because this surface will be butting to the another assembly and I would be interested in knowing the flatness of this surface at the same time uh, eccentricity of the circular. How do we get started? I will be selecting a one node form, one node form this circular feature. In the geometry, I will be going and selecting the nodes on the same surface. As you can see that it has selected all the nodes on that surface. And then I go into the view tab in the in user interface, start the command line and type in roundness. Roundness and hit enter. As it, the API works in the background, application programming interface or the script, you would able to know that what was the roundness before as a geometry and what is the roundness after an actual eccentricity after the deflections. Probably this would be very essential informations when you are doing a tolerance stack type of analysis. So this was to know that how I can calculate the eccentricity with few clicks. Let's get, good, uh, get back to the another that I would be interested in knowing the flatness of the surface. Again, I would be selecting a node and then in the geometry and with that the selection tool I would be selecting the nodes on the same surface. You could see that I have selected the nodes on the same surface and this time I would be using the another command line that is flatness. And you can see that the flatness before the warp was zero of course it's a it's a reference geometry and then with reference to that it, it shows that okay flatness is of like 23 microns also. I hope this script would be very helpful in getting uh, results related to flatness and eccentricity and provide the valuable information to the engineering and product development team. Thank you for your time.